Hey guys, what's going on? And boy, does it feel good to be back. I have been at my mom's for the past about five days, and I haven't been able to make any videos, so the videos you guys have been seeing these past uh, like five days have been just pre-recorded videos that I set up to post while I was gone. And it's back, and it feels good. I'm excited to get back and make some videos for you guys. And we got the gold buys in here. Good old gold. I haven't put ever had the, even seen the gold buys in before, and actually it looks pretty nice. One gun I don't like it on is the MTAR. That's why I have I, I put gold cam on all my uh, guns right now, for the moment, except for the MTAR, just because I don't feel like it looks good on that gun. It looks good on all the others, but not that one. But we're gonna start this off. We're facing a 33 and 12 guy in singles, of course. And uh, yeah, he's also a 12k MLG rank. So we'll see how we do against him. This will be map one, and we'll take it from here. After this. You know, we'll probably end up doing like map 2 and map 3 and stuff, depending on how these maps go. And live coming those as well. So we're just going to straight up push right through this. My first singles in a while, believe it or not, because while I was um, at my mom's house, internet's pretty bad. So I was, I've been playing some TL and stuff, but haven't even bothered with singles because I didn't want to risk losing it. Because I got to play on like a 36 inch TV. And I'm used to playing on a 24 inch monitor. And then on top of that, I gotta deal with this terrible internet there, so I just didn't want to bother with it. But this is a new spot. I found out that long ago, and it's where it work out works out pretty well. It really wasn't the preferred spot that I would sit in for the buys, and I don't really know why I went over here. I should have just sat in the corner of the ladder room, which is what I usually prefer to do. But that spot's really good, guys, if you want to um you know a good playing spot. I used to just lay prone. Um, in a little indent there in the scaffold thing, but now I just watch Blue Romans. Pretty effective, pretty effective. But I'm gonna take off the bison because I don't really want to just stick with this. But he broke B glass, so odds are he's gonna be popping out here. So switch right to the Remington, and I'm right now I'm watching my caution and all of A cross, so I know if he crosses into research. And I'm also watching the uh, right to the bottom left of my screen right now. So if he pushes blue stairs, but he's not pushing blue stairs, so I'm gonna just ADS this, and I'm still watching the A cross, and I'm also all right. So he planted, and we're gonna see if he crosses the research. He does, so we have a really good uh, spot on him right now. Just gonna play this slow, so we know he's gonna be over here. So we gotta be ready for that, and we catch him in the corner of the boxes. I knew he'd be over here somewhere, but when I went out to check the uh, the conveyor belt, I was nervous because you can either be in the front, which is what some people do, and some other people also lay in the back. So it's just like a 50-50 chance that I could get shot in the back. But he wasn't either of those spots. He was right on the the uh, crates, right, uh, the boxes right there, and he was just watching the bomb from there, just sitting in the corner watching his back. But we pushed at just the right time and managed to get a nice, easy flank on this guy to give us a 2-0 lead. Now, since I got the Remington out, I'm going to play nice and slow, which is what I traditionally prefer to do on this map. I, I play really, really well when I play really slow and just take it one round at a time and just focus on winning my rounds. You know, don't worry about the big picture. Who cares that I'm up 2-0? Uh, and I choked those shots pretty bad. I was in the middle of a sentence and I don't know. Oh well. Nerves that he's gonna... Shit. Didn't want to do that. Uh, I'm just gonna... Go ahead and just push my... Alright, he did something weird. Oh, well, we choked that round, guys. We choked that round. I was in the middle of talking. This guy was watching the crosses and stuff. I honestly thought he pushed my caution, so I was going to try to flink around him again. But he didn't do that. But not all I could have done. I probably should have just pushed back and watched my own, my own cross as well. That would have been acceptable. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna go to my sound horror spot. I'm just gonna sound horror the bomb. Let's be honest. Just gonna sit in this corner. ADS B Dom and sound horror or B. Time's almost up.
Oh, and he... Damn it. I rarely ever die in this spot. Like, I know people know about it, but nobody really runs around checking spots like this. Whatever. Well played. It's you just checking spots, I guess. Search and destroy. Alright. Let's see. What I think I'm gonna do go with the bison again. Do the same strategy I did the first round, except instead of laying in that uh, blue blue box spot on the other side, I'll, I think we're just gonna lay prone and ladder. And if I don't want to do that, I could also lay in my other blue box spot right in front of me. But we'll see what we want to do. So we're all good. Let me just check the corners of this. So we're good to go. I'm gonna plant the bomb on this side, I think. If I could just fucking get on it. Alright, hopefully it doesn't pop up yellow series, that's my only concern. But he doesn't, and we managed to get to our spot. Really just gonna lay prone here. Hopefully he doesn't climb up the ladder. Awesome. Excellent job, Ghost. Get ready for the next round. I'm surprised this dude didn't check the corner, because that's one thing I always do. You know, it's hard to outgun him if I am laying here. It is hard to outgun me, because I am in the corner, and I'm laying prone, ready for you. But at the same time, you don't just want to sprint through like that, because people do like to sit in the ladder, and if you're gonna sit in the ladder, a lot of people do like prying. Search and destroy. All right, all right, all right, all right. I'm gonna jump on the lights. I think this round because I really need to take a two-round lead on this guy. I took it in the beginning, but then he started taking some rounds from me. And trading rounds really isn't something I'm looking to do right now. I'm looking on taking a nice lead on him. And I, I always watch my back when I climb this now, just cause in case somebody rushes me or something like that. Alright, so. We got our eyes on blue stairs, all of A, B dom, really everything. This is such a powerful spot. But if he does push down to uh, my scaffolding straight from Snake, which he's not doing, he's actually planning A right now. Boom. Job, we hit him just like I said I just need to win that one round and now I got a nice two round lead which is awesome and with that two round lead I can extend on that and if I do choke around here and there like I did in the beginning that's fine you know you can afford to choke one round now but we don't want to even think about choking rounds we want to focus on getting all the rounds we can get at the moment and that's gonna be my goal People don't seem to pop out anymore. Like, I remember I used to get picks all the time. You know, I'd break glass just down here, and people would always push up on B-side. And nobody does that anymore. I wouldn't say my strat's common at all. Time's almost up. I don't know where this guy was, but we got an easy kill on him. Not bad. I almost got terrible timing, because if he, if he walked out when I was watching... Check my beat on corners, he would add me. But we hit our shots. Aim's still a little bit shoddy because we're getting to this uh, regular size monitor again. But that's what we're here for. We're here to warm up, practice, and get in the groove for the singles grind for today. Currently, I'm 10th place right now, guys. And I really want to get that rank up before playoffs. I, I wanna, my goal is to get it to back to 5th. That's what I'm going to try to do. 5th or 4th is what I'm going to try to go for. I'm going to see if I can catch him pushing underground or snake. Or not snake, uh, green room. But he's not pushing either. He's not budging. Now, at this point, I really don't know what the hell I'm doing. <laughs> um, I don't know. I I forgot I already used that spot. So, I'm not going to go there again. But we're just going to sit here, I guess. And I'm watching my caution. I'm also watching my snake. And at the same time, I can see if he pushes up from blue room. If he decides to do that. Alright, so we just saw him. He's going to blue stairs. 
runs up those stairs. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. 